100 push-ups, 100 squats. So we're going to start off with normal push-ups, skate down to knees, then go to flower bed, then go to tires, then go to barbecue stuff. They're all set in different parts. Okay. You can scale up. Right. So it's a bit easier, okay? Let's go for it. As many as you can get before you fail. for all 100 standard with his 15 kilogram vest on very good once you fail knees that's it knees keep going keep going until you fail that's it keep going i'll show you the next one so once you fail on your knees you go across the flower bed this way like that <laughs> Once you fail on that, we're then going to get you onto the tyre. Don't go onto the glass, but lean onto the tyre and do exactly the same. That's it. So we're trying to get that fatigue, that build up of lactic acid, that fighters fatigue, okay? How many you want? 42. 42, right, onto the barbecue. And then you are at a point where you are going to need a rest, because other than doing up against the fence, but I'm, <laughs> there's no benefit. Nice. Good, looking good, looking good. That fatigue sets in quick, doesn't it? <laughs> how many more? How many more? Fifty six. Once you reach failure, onto squats, okay? Guitar, since you could do anything, kid, you could go far. You could be the president, fireman, race cars. The sky's the limit, kids, so shoot for the stars. So I strum that guitar every day. Right, let's get on squats. The passion for music never went away. I joined a couple bands and played a few shows. Tried to impress the girl. Sit straight on it. Perfect. Soon enough, everything starts to change. As you grow up, nobody treats you the same. They try to push up to you and make you real safe. You could be a doctor, accountant, or something sane. But yo, whatever happened to the sky was the limit. I fell in love with music, never thought it was a gimmick. I worked so hard on every tune and every single lyric. My whole identity depends on my energy. You can see a separation of that. It's really, really good. Have you noticed? <laughs> Massive mate, let me show you on the <laughs> Massive quad separation on there now. Not just randomly zooming in on your groin, I promise. Yeah, really, really good. Really, really good. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Yeah, you'll see on the video. Really good quad separation. Every day, every day. Come on, let's go. Right, let's sit from here. Let's go. Yeah, man. Keep going. How is that? 43, get 50. Yeah, go, 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 go. Nice. Let's push up for Again. Start breaking push ups. Now back to the tire. And once you reach further than that, we've got flower bed. Should be easier, but it's not. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> doing good, man, doing good. If it was easy, everyone would do it. <laughs> I'm on that fight, it's fatigue, mate. Tire first. Scale it up. 
And that's it, dude. Nice, how many left? Cool. Get it done, that's great. If not, back on squats. Sit, push it, push it, push it, dig deep. Sit, back on squats. How many more? 20. Okay. And how many more squats? Let's do it. That's when the medicine ball hit the stomach. It's the biggest difference. Doing good, man. Doing good. I'll keep this in live time as well so people can see how fast you do it. Okay, tire. How many more? Okay, at least you're being honest, man. I count eight more left. Either that or one of us can't count. Probably me. <laughs> You've run out of squats to do, haven't you? Just go get it done, dude. That's it, go get it done. Yeah, I've deliberately got everything around this training centre to be different heights for this reason. So, well done, man. Well done. Okay, right. Get yourself laid down. We're going straight onto impact training. Okay, straight onto it. Right. Lay down. It's going to be a V hold. Okay. 
你嗰啲咩閪啊？ Alexa for you know three。Good, take a rest. You've got 30 seconds away. Then we're rinsing and repeating. You see why that fatigue is there? Alexa, snooze for 30 seconds. Back on B-Hall. Alexa, pause. Okay, I'm bring you out. Okay, I'll bring you out. Me too. One chance to prove it to yourself, so don't lose it. You got the stamp, just keep pushing on through it. One day you'll look back, so glad you pursued it. Things are gonna get better. The next step is obviously a big ball. Yeah, I'ma just do me, you just do you. I swear it's gonna get better real soon. Don't let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. Alexa, snooze for 30 seconds, last round. Then we're going to get on to learning something again. We're just drilling what we've done before, so front kick, jab, cross, jab, switch. Nice roundhouse. That's it, chop choy, ginger boy. I'll shut up and let you get on with it. You was doing it fine until I got the camera out. Nice. Keep drilling, keep drilling, keep drilling. Nice. Okay. Okay, think about that chop choy. Think about that ginger boy. At the moment, you're just flapping your arm around, okay? You must be positive. In, out, bang, okay? That's it. Nice, that's it. Think about it, think about it. There we go. Perfect. Keep drilling it. Forward kick. One, two, three. That's it. Roundhouse. Yep, that's it, that's it. Chop, Troy, Ginger Boy. Guard up, bounce back. Okay, you're always fighting, you're always fighting, you're always defending, okay? Keep that guard. That's it. Chop, Troy, Ginger Boy. Guard, bounce back. Perfect. Okay, defend at all times, okay? Sure, that's been in movies before. I'm not quoting movies. That's it. Nice switch. Roundhouse. Nice. Chop joy. Ginger boy. That's it. Bounce back. Good, good, good. Keep light on those feet, okay? I want to see that bounce. You're doing like three bounces when it could just be one. Chop joy. Ginger boy. Switch. That's better. That's better. Perfect. Nice and light on those feet. I know you got the fighters fatigue now, but keep light on those feet. Nice. So what this is all about is shielding and guarding a chop choy ginger boy, which is a back fist and a club. Um, so the chop choy ginger boy, I would never recommend leading with it. I'd never recommend even thinking about it, if I am to be perfectly honest with you. It's something that if you panic um, and you find yourself in the opposite stance or something, it's really, really effective. It will just happen naturally, because your natural instinct for most things is to go, go away, go away, go away. Okay, so it'll, it'll naturally kind of happen. If you plan to do it, it'll never work. Um, but you will see an opportunity and it'll just, if you drill it enough, you get what's called muscle memory, it will just happen. So what's important with it is you've got to know how to shield and guard. Now there's, um, I don't know if you've heard of uh, Defence Academy or Defence Lab or anything like that. They are massive into this kind of shielding and defending and fighting like this and rotating around and, and everything. It just seems like they can't see anything at any time. But essentially, that's shielding and guarding. It's really, really useful. Um, I don't know enough about defence lab or defence um, science or anything to be able to critique or comment. But it works really well with, with anything that's going towards the temple chop try ginger boy. I personally wouldn't fight like that, but it's not because I'm dissing the, the martial arts, because I don't understand it. <laughs> I don't, I've never done it, so I, I've only seen it. Um, and I've been, when I was taught from my sensei, it was kind of, oh, this this is where this kind of derives from. Um, so yeah, let's go for it. So what we're going to do is you're basically going to just step forward into your into your opposite stance. So literally like a switch, okay? You're going to then chop choy. So 
So I'm going to go like that, then you're going to ginger boy as you go under, I'm going to go like that. And just remove my hair. Excuse the hair, there's nothing on it. I'm going to look like a racing pigeon. Okay, so you're going to go into your normal stance, literally just switch through, and as you switch, I'm going to go like that, and as you go under, I'm going to go like that. So all I'm doing with my hands is I'm going from a Dutch guard, or a long guard, doesn't really matter. I'm essentially like combing my hair, and keep it close, I'm combing my hair, and keep it close. That's essentially all it is. Um, and the reason why you're kind of combing it is because you're spreading the impact across hand, forearm, shoulder, you know, a little bit of tricep, a little bit of bicep. As you're going like that, it's essentially spreading the impact. If someone's going to hit you on your temple, it can be really lights out and it can be a real big problem. So we've got to drill this, okay? What's important is that we actually, as the point of impact, we push away. Otherwise, all that happens is they're going to hit the glove. The glove's going to hit it anyway, and it's just going to feel like you've been hit anyway. Okay, so the last thing you want to do is just go through like that and be like, you know, take the hit. You want to essentially brush your hair, but brush it away, if that makes sense. So kind of, you're pushing away to be able to absorb the impact. Okay, Alexa, five minutes. So we're just going to drill it. Okay, so now, touch gloves. Let's go for it. So you're going to go five times, I'm going to go five times. So step in, that's it. That's it, go back out. So again. That's it, perfect. Nice. Okay, one more. So, right, might go okay. So I'm gonna step in, I'm gonna go top join, I'm gonna go ginger boy. Okay, perfect, okay. So essentially, if you ever block it with the elbow on their forearm, they're gonna really know about it. So there's always a good point in that as well. So I'm gonna step in, top join, that's it, ginger boy. See, that elbow's perfect position for where I'm going, okay? So chop join, that's it, ginger boy. Perfect. Okay, I've got the back of your head then. Okay. That's it. Okay. That's better. I think I keep tapping the back of your head sometimes, don't I? Okay. That's better. It's really good, it's really good. So literally just like that and straight back down again. Okay, you're five. Let's swap. Let's get it from a different angle than an angle. And then we'll stop the camera and we'll just crack on again, okay? So, step in. <laughs> yeah. Three more. Okay, here might go. Let's go. Faster with more intent, okay? okay. Sometimes someone's up, we've got the shower on. <laughs> okay, go again. See it, hit me. Hit me. I'm not counting them yet, go. Harder. Okay. One, that's alright, go. Two. Three. Four. Five, good. So the other thing that I've noticed I'm doing that you're not, I didn't mention it, my fault. Chin down, okay? Look up, chin down. So if you're gonna take the impact, you're not, ooh, okay? So chin down, I'm gonna go exactly the same. Okay, that's it. Good, that elbow's right in the, <laughs> right in the center of it. Good. Perfect, perfect. That feels safe? Yeah, it's good. Okay, I'm going to pause this, we're going to keep drilling it, 